guys! So this video is going to be a bit of an exciting one. It's going to be a Makeup Revolution haul, as I'm sure you can tell from the title. And I did a pretty big order with Makeup Revolution last week, I think it was. And I've been wanting to get some of their stuff for quite a while because it's a company here in the UK that you can get in Superdrug and obviously online. And it's known for kind of making dupes of higher end products, which is what I'm all about. So I thought I would get some of the stuff from their website and I'd seen a few things that I liked. And yeah, I was just really excited to try some of their products. So I did a bit of a cheeky purchase and my parcel arrived the other day. So I thought I would do a haul for you guys. So I have my bag of stuff here and I'm just gonna go through it as I pick things out. Also, another thing, sorry about my t-shirt. I I was wearing a random t-shirt and I did all my makeup nice and I did all my hair nice and then I thought I've got to change this t-shirt but it's got a really small neck and I did not want to risk messing up my makeup or my hair so I left it on and I hope you guys don't mind. So the first thing I got which I was super excited to try was one of their iconic palettes I think. This one is called the Redemption Palette Iconic 3 and this is supposed to be a dupe, dupe, dupe for the Naked 3 palette which I have wanted for a while and as you can see it just has a range of pinky neutral shades and this was £4 I believe. Let me check my paper. So yeah this was £4 and I think that is such good value. It comes with 12 different shades and they're all really pretty kind of pinky neutral colours well basically it's like exactly the same colours as the Naked 3. Um, and it comes with one of these little foam brush things but yes it's a really beautiful palette and I really wanted to give it a go so I bought this so the next thing which is another thing that I am so excited about I basically wanted the Lorac Pro palette for so long and this is their dupe of the Lorac Pro duh. and it's called the Iconic Pro 1 and it comes in a box like this very expensive looking and oh mine's a bit grabby but the packaging is just matte black with the gold revolution logo which I quite like and it actually says on the box that there's a new edition which comes with a professional makeup brush so I thought that was also quite good um, so when you open it up it's just got a massive mirror which is a bonus um, and then oh lots of glare it has all of these shades here and they're, again, they're just identical dupes to the Lorac Pro palette and it has the names of all the eyeshadows on this little insert thing which is one of the only things that I don't really like about these palettes is that, for well, for this one and the one I'm about to show you it has the names of the eyeshadows on a little plastic thing so if you end up throwing this away or losing it then you don't know what the names are which is quite sad. But yeah, it does actually come with a little brush and it's got a flat shader brush on one side and then a blending brush on the other side which I think is a really good thing to have because so many eyeshadow palettes in the drugstore don't have quality makeup brushes that come with them and this one is pretty good if you don't have any makeup brushes. Um, so yeah, this palette seems like it's going to be amazing and I'm sure it will be in future videos. Next up is actually the main reason why I ordered from Makeup Revolution. I just could not resist buying this because it looks amazing. It is Makeup Revolution's dupe for the Too Faced Chocolate Bar palette and it's called the I Heart Chocolate palette and it does look like a chocolate bar. If I just take it out of the box to show you. Um, on the back of the box it's just got a picture of all the eyeshadows it comes with. It comes with 16 different shades. And again, the colours are all dupes of the actual high-end product, which I think is amazing. And it just looks like this. It's got a little chocolate bar and then dripping chocolate, which I think is so cute. And I am a sucker for cute packaging, as I've mentioned before. So, ooh, I can't open it. I'm opening it the wrong way. So again, when you open it, it's just got one of these plastic inserts with all the colour names on it. It's got a mahoosive mirror like the other one. And yeah, it's just got 16 amazing neutral shades, which, sorry about the glare, which are amazing dupes and I'm actually going to be filming a prom tutorial which is probably going to feature this palette and maybe some of the others, so I'm quite excited to film that. The colour pigmentation of these is so amazing, I will do some close-ups while I'm playing this, 
what am I saying? Yeah, so I am so excited to try these palettes. So it turns out I did actually buy quite a lot of eyeshadows. It was an accident, I'm just addicted to buying them, okay, I'm sorry. I got one of the Awesome Metals Foil Finish eyeshadows, and I had seen Glitter A Little, I think that's her YouTube name. Yeah, I've seen her mention this in one of her videos and do a tutorial with it, and I'd actually ordered it before that, but when I saw it in that video, I was like, oh my god, I can't wait for it to arrive, and it's basically just a foil eyeshadow. I got mine in the shade Rose Gold, and in the box is just this little eyeshadow which is the product itself and like I said it's in the shade Rose Gold it's basically just a really beautiful foil eyeshadow and I've wanted one of these for quite a while because I wanted to experiment with some more glittery shades on my eyeballs the box actually comes with this itself which is the eyeshadow it then comes with a little primer potion thing not primer potion but like little liquid eyeshadow stuff and then you're supposed to take a bit of each so a couple of drops of this and then you scrape off some of the eyeshadow and then you mix it in this little palette which it comes with which is quite handy and then it just applies a lot smoother and it will stay on longer I'm guessing so that is another thing that I am really excited to try I've just realised I've completely forgot to tell you the prices of these things so the Iconic 3 palette at the beginning was £4, which I did mention. The Iconic Pro 1 palette, which is the dupe of the Lorac Pro palette, is £6.99. The I Heart Chocolate palette was £7.99. And the eyeshadow foil that I just mentioned in the shade Rose Gold was £4. So yeah, as you can see, all these products are super affordable and... They seem like they're going to be amazing, to be honest. I'm always happy for a good dupe. So next, I just got two of their Pure Pigment eyeshadows. I think that's what they're called. Yeah, Pure Pigments. And these are basically just loose eyeshadows. And I have one of these on my eyes today. And I have the shade Indirect, which is a really pretty kind of champagne pink colour. And it's beautiful. And the other shade I have is Dynamic, which is a more kind of coppery colour. Again, it's beautiful. And these were... These were only £1, which is amazing because you get quite a lot of product. I mean, they look really small, but you know how eye dusts are, they kind of last forever. So yeah, this is such an amazing price. So I kind of want to go and buy all of these because they had quite a lot of colours to choose from. And yeah, really loving them so far. On to some face products. I keep rustling this bag, I'm sorry if that annoys people. Or if you can even hear it, I don't know. So the next thing is a face product. This is a blush, and this is a... And it is a... And it is one of their blushing hearts, and of course, this is a dupe for the Too Faced blushes, Love Heart blushes, I have no idea what they're called. Um, but yeah, if I just open it up for you, this is in the shade Bursting with Love. It's got this really, really similar cardboard packaging. It's just pink on this side, and then it has gold on the back, and when you open it, it's just got the three shades here. It's absolutely beautiful, and... I just, I, I couldn't resist buying it, it was too cute to resist. So this blusher was 4 99 which again I think is a bargain. So the final two things I have to mention are two of their lip lovers and these were 2 99 I just got mine in the shades, I got a nude one which is in the shade Forgiven which is what I'm wearing on my lips now. I got a pinky one in the shade Tremor as well, and I was going to get more, but I was spending so much money at this point, well not so much money, the whole thing came to like £35, which is amazing for how much makeup I got, but I didn't really want to spend much more money, so unfortunately I didn't get the whole set, but I'm sure I'll be buying more of these because, again, they're another dupe of the Too Faced, what are they called? You know exactly what I'm talking about, but it's just gone out of my mind. Too faced, liquid, melted, something. They basically look exactly the same. Ooh, can't open it. So they just come in a little squeezy tube like this, and when you open them, they have a little foam applicator thing, and I apologise that mine is dirty, but I've already used it. So yeah, so far I really like these, they're really pigmented, as you can probably see. Uh, actually, I'm not really sure if you can see because it's a nude color. But yeah, they're really pigmented, they go on really smoothly, um, they feel really moisturising. They're not like super glossy because I don't really like super glossy lip glosses. Um, and it's kind of like, well obviously it's a liquid lipstick, um, but it's kind of a satin finish I would say. Um, so yeah, I really like these so far. 
they don't smell of anything. I kind of wish they smelled of chocolate, but they don't. But yeah, these are amazing, and for only two ninety nine, I think that is an absolute bargain. And you can actually buy the whole set, I believe, for about fifteen pounds. Maybe I'm off by one or two pounds. But yeah, you can buy the whole set, which I think is amazing. They've also got like a purple shade, which is, I think, an exact dupe for one of the Too Faced melted lipsticks. Um, and they also have a bright red shade and a more corally shade. So yeah, I really like these lip lovers so far. So that is everything I bought from Makeup Revolution. And so far, I'm pretty impressed with their product. And I'm sure I'll be buying more in the future. They're really good value, and I love dupes for high products because let's face it who can be spending 35 pounds or 40 pounds on an eyeshadow palette when you can be buying one for like a quarter of the price not even a quarter of the price like a tenth of the price I can't do maths when you can buy one for much cheaper <laughs> I hope you guys enjoyed this whole video and I hope some of you found it helpful if you like this video please give it a big thumbs up so yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and if you aren't already subscribed, then please subscribe to me if you want to, I'm not forcing you into it. But yeah, um, so I will see you guys in my next video. Bye!